A year long controversy that began over a single book appears far from resolved in Iron River, Wisconsin. And Northern News Now's Madison Green went to the public library to learn what started it all and what some are doing in hopes of keeping it open. Last June, this book was in a display for Pride Month. Concerned residents soon questioned whether the book should stay in the library and asked that it be reviewed. Around the same time, an anonymous letter was sent to the library board. It is an important piece of material to have in our library. It serves a purpose. Is it for young children? No, it's not. Um, but it also covers, you know, topics of all different kinds of sexual activity. Can you show me where Let's Talk About It is? Sure. Yeah. Happy to. Thank you. Unfortunately, it, the conversation in the community has gone from the books that had more sexual education nature to it to even topics of LGBTQ folks. There's concern that they don't want those books to have representation in our library. Library advocate Rochelle Swanson says now the conversations have switched to completely shutting down the library, which would mean getting rid of something John Joseph and Dick Berge helped build. We helped a lot. <laughs> the shelving came and I almost sacrificed my F-150 to it. <laughs> They believe the library has too many more stories to tell. Shouldn't be locked out of some ideas. I think that's vital. I mean, that's for a good functioning society. And I saw this community kind of enlivened by the library. In Iron River, Madison Green, Northern News Now. Madison, thank you. Now, Northern News Now reached out to those in favor of shutting down the library and did not get a response. You can read the anonymous letter expressing their concerns right now on our website.